everybody so in this video I'm going to be multiplying binary numbers um, I have the key listed right here pretty much the only four rules you need to know uh, this is pretty much straightforward 0 times 0 is 0 1 times 0 0 0 times 1 is 0 and 1 times 1 is 1 so I have this uh, um, example right here and let's just uh, uh, let's just do this problem so just like uh, multiplying numbers uh, in decimal form. We're gonna say begin with the, the the one on the top row to the right. Multiply that, that, like that, and then move on to here. So same thing. If you have a zero here, then you can just pretty much write the four zeros because you have one times zero, zero, zero times zero, zero, one times zero, zero, one times zero, zero. So you have one, two, three, okay, four zeros. All right. Now we're gonna place a zero. I'm gonna put an arrow here. Put a zero and now we're going to multiply the second column in the bottom row so we have one times one one zero times uh, one zero times one one so you notice when you have a one on the bottom you're pretty much going to rewrite this number down if you have a zero you're pretty much going to write straight zeros so now we're going to add these two and we just have zero plus zero zero plus one zero plus zero one there's pretty much a zero right here and that would be one so this is your answer now let's check if it's right so we had one one zero one and in decimal let's convert them to decimal in decimal all right that would be the ones place the two the four the eight you can add eight plus four plus one 13 so we had 13 13 and this number would just be two in decimal so 13 times two 26. Now this number that we got should be 26 in binary uh, for it to be right. So, all right, so I'm going to rewrite that number. We have 1, 1, 0, 1, 0. This is the 1's place, the 2, 4, 8, and the 16's place. Okay, so we're just going to add the numbers that are activated that have a 1. 16 plus 8 plus 2, that would be 16 plus 10, that would be 26. And that is uh, the number.